So for the longest time I've had this crazy idea that a person could make complicated parts like a uh, turbine wheel or a compressor wheel on a manual mill. So I think maybe I kind of got an idea how to perform a crude shape that's going to be comparable-ish to it. I don't know if it's going to focus well enough or not to to see it. The light's kind of glaring on it, but anyways, this is just one cut of several that would be necessary to actually make a functioning turbine wheel. You can't really see it with the light the way it is. Yeah, that's a little better. Anyways, here I'll try and run you through this if my battery will last long enough. <clears throat> so, start out with this. Crank in a little ways. And I go to this. Then, I do a little bit of this. And I'm left with wood that's tore out on the end. But at any rate, you can kind of get an idea of what I'm trying to do here. It's multiple passes or multiple motions to get the tool path that I want. I'm kind of trying to mimic CNC-ish sort of motions to an extent. I still have to come up with another path to get this up, upper portion off and to get these edges rounded off when I get that far. So anyways I've got a long long ways to go with this yet. It's just baby steps. Just wanted to see if it was even remotely practical.